Hi mates, today we will be doing a full day in the life of an entrepreneur, online coach, influencer, whatever you want to call me. How I sort of set up my day and how everything goes. So stick around and watch it. I can hear. There's a drone. It's following me. What the f It's following me! <laughs> um, did I give you permission to record, sir? I don't think I did. Sir? <laughs> eyes don't open up they're like tall so we got check-ins now Monday morning check-ins so quite a lot of them we've got the new monitor and all here we've got the nice 49 inch QLED iPad Mac mini yeah it's just a much nicer setup and we're gonna be having another monitor up here we've got check-ins now gonna get them done and then I don't know what the next clip's gonna be so we'll see you there yes big dog hope you're all good thanks for sending your checking over nice and early in terms of workout everything looks good in terms of sort of stress and management and all of that fatigue is somewhat high so we will look to sort of take a deload over the next couple of weeks wait what happened last week obviously we're in a reversal phase at the moments we're sort of just looking for a tiny bit of weight gain but then it comes back down so 88 last week this week 88.3 so it's somewhat come down um but it is stalled um but what we want now is to sort of leave it so this week we won't be adding any food just because it's not come back down to what it was before so it has on average gone up but you can see here as it coming back down. So by the end of next week, weight will continue as it come back down and we can actually warrant the food then because we do want to see a bit of loss of weight just to sort of warrant that food. Any questions, bro, let me know and I'll see you throughout the week, bro. Yogurt, it's not going to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're grotty, dog. Check-ins are all done for the morning. We've got meal one here. We're falling slightly behind on schedule, but we're gonna go eat some food, chuck on some Dragon's Den, and we're gonna to reply to some clients just to make sure that they understand the check-in and sort of they've actually got a point of contact throughout the day. Because in the last video, like I said, if your coach takes three to four days to reply to you, it's a pen pal, not your fucking coach, mate. So, hi, my name's Tristan Barnes, the coach that will reply to you in an hour. Apply down below. <laughs> See you later. We just went Truro, Apple. Hold on. Found it. Apple trackpad, only because I've swapped to monitor and Mac Mini. Mac Mini. When I'm editing, I can't zoom and zoom out. I've tried game and mouse. No, you can't zoom and zoom out. And I literally tried every fucking button. So we've gone back to trackpad as the old MacBook. So I'm literally just going to go zoom in and zoom out to it. That's all it's for. And so, yeah. So we've got TCP smart plugs in. You might be thinking, why the f do I have those? It's because it's a bit my desk, lovely. Right, how do I turn it off? I know I'm thinking the same as you. Tristan's cable management is horrendous, so please bully him in the comments below for this. But now, back to the video. Like that. That is not optimal. So, we're going to get these, and hopefully, I can say Alexa, office on, Alexa, office off. All the lights and all the plug sockets will turn on in here. So, that is the plan of attack. Help! Step, bro, I'm stuck. I can't get out. Help me, please. <laughs> Fit your smart plug to a power supply and appliance, the light on the plug should start flashing rapidly. It's not. If the light does not flash quickly, hold down the power button for the side for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Yes. Step two. For troubleshooting, fuck off. Don't say it's got a download. So while I'm waiting for them to download and log apparently because it's a plug, we're going to answer some questions that you asked on Instagram story yesterday. If you're not following, go follow it. Always struggling with eating first thing in the morning. Just have no appetite. Any tips? Not got any appetite. Just don't eat in the morning. Just have it a bit later. Or you're bulking and you've got no appetite. Go for a little walk. Walking aids digestion. So by the time you come back from a walk, bingo bango, you're hungry. Any tips for a cracking tan before I go on holiday? Now, sometimes you've got to embrace the Casper the Ghost vibe because at the end of the day, skin cancer may not be worth it for you. However, I do not recommend sunbeds. It is a stupid idea, but that's a risk you're willing to take. Before holiday, four weeks before, I would go first week, three lots of maybe six to eight minutes. Second week, three lots of 
eight to 10 minutes. Third week, three lots of 10 to 12 minutes. And then if you're feeling dangerous, fourth week, so one week away from your holiday, go three lots of 12 to 15 minutes, depending on how hot your sunbeds are. I think these are done, so let's go. At the moment, we've got it working. So if I go, Alexa, turn off office. Okay. Wash. In one minute, it will all turn on. Five, four, three, two, one. That's what you call optimal, mate. Ow. Gym time. Pre-workout, contest sport mega pump. You cannot beat it, I promise you. Three snacker jacks for draw on the way to the gym for intra carbs. Alexa, train chest for me. Oh, wait, you can't do that for fuck's sake. <laughs> That is the day done pretty much. Got to sign up one more client tonight and then make a new program for a new client tonight as well. Eight o'clock now, so I'll probably finish around nine, ten-ish, which is normal, and then you go to bed. Wake up the next day, all starts again. Post-workout, chicken and rice here. Thank you for watching. We're trying to hit 10,000 subscribers. We're at 9K at the moment, so just please subscribe if you're new. Please. What will you do if they hit 10K? Shove it.